All right, Green Valley, you look like, man, you guys look sharp. All right, I think we're ready to go. Uh, without any further ado, the Green Valley Jazz Band. Here we go. Thank you. Our first tune we're going to start with is a Latin tune called Vamanos. Vamanos. <laughs> That featured Nathan on tenor sax. Yeah. And Sophia Kim on trumpet. Sophia Kim on trumpet. Yeah. All right, we're changing out our bass player, our drummer, and our keyboard player. And this next tune is a Van Morrison piece. It's called Moon Dance, a uh, famous tune. Kind of has become a jazz standard, even though it's sort of in that rock thing. Uh, and this is going to feature uh, Paul Lee, Lauren Wright on keyboards, <laughs> Nina Gonzalez on very sax, <laughs> Carly on flute, <laughs> and Kieran on tenor sax. Here we go. Moon dance. Thank you. 
All right, thank you. All right, we're gonna finish our set with a tune called Malibu Drive. And we're gonna switch out bass players, guitar, drums, keyboard. All right. Malibu Drive. And this is going to feature Nathan, Gabe, anybody else? Maya. Is that it? All right. Nathan, Gabe. All right, here we go. Malibu Drive.
as most of you don't know, we're losing two amazing educators this year to retirement. Mr. Wally Hunt, who's in the audience, I believe. Where's Wally? Are you backstage? He's in the green room. And Mr. Daniel Peckham has announced his retirement. So I have a little something I just want to read for, for Dan, and uh, we have a little presentation for him tonight. Uh, Dan Peckham received his Bachelor's of Arts in Music from Cal California State University Hayward in 1984. I just started high school. <laughs> He began his teaching career in the 86-87 school year in the Richmond Unified School District and taught there for five years. In 1991, he was hired at the Fairfield Sassoon Unified School District and taught seven years at Anna Kyle Elementary School. Yeah, man. In 1998, he transferred to and taught at Nelda Mundy for six years. Yeah, it's a career there. And for the past 15 years to the present, he's been working at Green Valley Middle School. Uh, Dan was voted Teacher of the Year by staff and was uh, while he was at Nelda Monday and later voted Teacher of the Year while he was at Green Valley Middle School. <laughs> we asked Dan for a few notes on, on, on what he kind of remembers and what he's most proud of and, and Dan said, he's particularly proud of the work he's done developing the concept of the drum circle. In the engaging activity, students are introduced to rhythm, improvisation, and a direct in the moment experience of music. The guitar program he initiated at Green Valley has offered a unique musical experience for students who may not have been attracted to a more traditional band program. Absolutely. And this last thing he'd like to, to mention to you here is he doesn't really like the word retirement. So after leaving teaching, I plan on pursuing, or Dan plans on pursuing a deeper understanding of music, cooking, learning Spanish, reading, meditating, gardening, enjoying the outdoors, traveling, and finding ways to make this world a more harmonious place. plan was to have you come up here but I think with our different sets it'll be more challenging so if you are a music teacher or a retired music teacher in the house please stand where you are and you are going to be a part of this presentation so I see Mr. Foreman up there awesome all right I'd like to introduce Ms. Joan Gott, board member and also a retired music teacher. Good evening. On behalf of Music for Our Children and the Fairfield Sassoon Unified School District Music Teachers, I'm going to present this plaque to Daniel Peckham. It says, in honor of your retirement and in recognition of your 18 years of service as a music educator in the Fairfield Sassoon Unified School District, we appreciate and, oh, excuse me. We appreciate all. Oh, this is hard to read. All your shared talents, perseverance, and dedication to our students' music education from the Fairfield Sassoon Unified School District music teachers. much just quick quick thing um, you know if I think back you know you ask somebody you know what do you want to be when you grow up the radar of being a music teacher was not there I was not on my plans okay so as things evolved all I can say is that um, there are certain experiences in my life which gave me a passion for music I remember when I was four 
sitting in my living room, and I was the youngest of five brothers, boys, and uh, they were all at school. I was four. My mom put on a recording of um, Prokofiev's Peter and the Wolf, and that story and the music, just as a kid, just took me to this level. So that's the connection everyone that wants to be in music needs to find. And I don't think any of the students here that are playing haven't found that. That's probably why they're here pursuing it. Because once you find that, the love of music is what carries it. Uh, so it's been, it's been one of what you call it, a, it's been a great run. <laughs> and especially, you know, the, the real treat is the relationships, personal, uh, with the students, um, seeing their growth. You know, they, they're the ones that teach you. Every day you go into that classroom, they're teaching you how to teach. And that's really a beautiful thing. Uh, plus, just all the, the uh, friendships you make with families in the community and over the years. And it's, that's, that's special, and that's been a real treat for me. And so I want to thank all the former music directors, directors, students, families, parents, just, yeah, let's keep it, keep it going. All right, thank you. Okay, well, I don't think we're gonna be selling any more tickets. So all of you that are standing, there's more than enough seats up top, down low. Please find a seat at this point. If we can get some more air in the house, that'd be great. Let's get a little stuffy. It's because of all the hot jazz in here, man. Yeah, that was a good set, right?